Hello and welcome to our new offshoot from our main channel, Marking New Menus. Oh, that's close. <laughs> I said that right, hopefully. Yes, you did. Because obviously our main channel is called Making New Memories. But this is where we go out and we try food and drink at a canal or riverside hostelry of some description. Could be a restaurant, could be a cafe, could be a pub whatever could even be um like the little shacks and they do homemade scones and stuff like that yeah yep. Yeah. could be anything yeah or it could be something close by a canal or river that anybody who would be boating would like to stop at and maybe try they're listed in all of the um, canal guides like pearson's and uh, nicholson's <laughs> but nobody's actually gone out and done any guides about what the food is and what's on the menu. So we thought, having been to the Cotton Arms in Renbury, we would try and do something similar to that, where we go out, we try something on the menu, and we give it a mark out of 10. Now, in terms of the Cotton Arms, I had a beautiful pie, because it was pie and pint Wednesday. I mean, <laughs> you're on a winner already <laughs> with me with that one. <laughs> Pubs, please take note. Um, and you had, I you had, had the a burger. burger. And that was lovely, wasn't it? Yeah, it was just too much for me, but I can't criticise that. It tasted lovely. And I just had little fries with it. Yeah. But yeah. And I think if we were gonna, if we were gonna mark that and going back to that experience, I'd, I would definitely give them that a nine out of 10. What would you give it? Eight. Oh, okay. So I think on average that's eight and a half out of ten. Yeah. Yeah. So the Cotton Arms gets an eight and a half out of ten. Yeah, because your pie was absolutely beautiful. It was homemade, the pastry, and it, it, it yours was, I think yours was a better value for money than mine. Mine was nice, but it was yeah. what it was, a burger and fries. Yeah, yeah. Um, but yeah, that Cotton Arms does specials like that. So Pie and Pint Wednesday, I think there's curry nights and things like that. So yeah, yeah worthwhile giving it a try. Because like I say, there are two pubs. Well, technically there's three, but mainly there's two pubs if you're more up uh, near Wenbury on the Langothlin Canal. Shh. Can't tell you about the other one. But what we can say is that we will be posting these occasionally, maybe once a month. Keep an eye out for them. I can't wait for this. Oof. And as Jan's said before, Wind and dined. as Jan says before, have a look at the ones that we've already filmed and got in the can, as they say for you. Here's a little taster. Mmm. Guacamole hummus. That's got a kick to it. It's got aubergine in. Salt cod fritters. We're going to share it because I wouldn't be able to eat that and a main meal as well. It's the loomy fries. Eight ounce sirloin steak, mm. mushroom salad and onion rings. We haven't had a steak in ages, have we? No. The lamb burger came raw in the middle. He grabbed all the female attention when he played a character called Rocky. And I'm guessing that's why this is called a Rocky Burger. Sizes and everything, Jan. Mm. Grilled halloumi, asparagus, peas. It's a butter bowl. They weren't triple cooked fries. Melt in your mouth and stop wiping your face with a tissue. It's embarrassing. <laughs> Don't know what I do. Maybe we shouldn't have had the starter. Oh, now then. Now then. <laughs> Something to look forward to. Yeah, right? let's put the cat amongst, amongst the pigeons. Yes, and quite a cross section of food. Not just meat, some vegetarian dishes in there as and well. And there was a vegan. And a vegan dish. Yeah. Wow. So, yeah. So keep an eye out for it, um, marking new menus, and we'll see you next time. Thanks very much. Bye.